Hello, welcome to Billy Nursery. This is Baby Faye. She's uh, reborn by Lana Miller Sand. This is my beautiful baby. She have on, um, I almost say it's like a tan and gold because she got the gold up here on her sweater to go with the dress and then she got this tan going around. Then she got the socks on with her gold, her shoes are gold and tan, and her got gold on her bow or her sock. And this is baby Faye, y'all. This is her. Guys, I haven't did a video, and I think I'm going to keep it. Just going to say, <coughs> not for kids. Guys, I've been sick, and then I end up with the I thought it was my tonsil because I couldn't swallow. It hurt for like four or five days. I couldn't swallow. I, I put something in my mouth, liquor. I had to let it go down a little bit because it hurt so bad. But the medication is working so I can swallow. I still sound terrible. And I know I'm not out of the wood. So I'm going to just take care of me. And before the end, I had a concussion. I... Uh, being clumsy, I had company and I went into the pantry and I was getting something out the pantry and they said something to me and as I was coming out, I closed the door and I looked back talking and the door hit me so hard and knocked me over to the window. If you knew how my kitchen made, man, you would say, ooh, that was a, you flew. Yes, I did. And I was knocked out. The paramedics were called. I had this big knot that we had to take off, like with ice. And it did go down, but I was having the dizzy and everything. And my doctor was telling me if I didn't rest, it can turn to vertical, vertical. And I didn't know what vertical was. My sister and mom explained it to me. And they said, I do not want it. And my friend got it, said, you do not want it, Billy. You do what that doctor say, where well, you won't have to be doing that because you won't be able to drive no more. But thank God, it's gone away. All the problem I'm having now is my left eye. Uh, I got a problem with my left eye. I can't see that good out of it. I can see bleary. It's bleary, but I can see out of it, but it's bleary. But I can see good out the um, right. So that's, but I'm not being ungrateful. I'm being thankful for that. But anyway, and now I'm trying to get over whatever this is I have. I'm taking the flu medicine and I didn't get a flu shot. And I said I wasn't because if I'm sick, I'm definitely not going to go take no flu shot. Then I end up really, really sick. I'm not going to do that one. Then once I feel better, I may go take a flu shot then, but I ain't doing it right now. And anyway, I come on to show my beautiful little girl. And guys, I got so many babies coming in. Uh, most of my collection is all new. So Sky is the oldest baby I ever had. You know, she's four years here. And look at my beautiful baby. Look how cute she is. I took her eyelashes out the top in the bottom and I asked one of the artists to tell me how to make her look cute because without them, she looked funny. And she told me to go get a dark pincer and just go over the line to go at the top and the bottom. And that's what I did. That's why she looked cute. Because she was looking funny at first, but she looked cute. And I, I just wanted to remove the glue and I did. I took all the glue off. She don't have no eyelashes. She just got that Dark pencil going around her eyes, see? At the top and the bottom, that's what she got. And she looked cute. Look at her in her gold and tan. She looks so beautiful. And guys, Star is gone. I'm not going to lie to you. I was feeling some type of way. Star been here for two years. And to let her go, I, I, I blamed it on me because I shouldn't have. But my kids remind me, Mom. You told us our whole life, suck it up. It is what it is. You had an opportunity to keep Star, and you didn't. You had both babies in possession, and that's true. And because you sent Star out, and I have her. She's beautiful. She's she's reborn by Baby Cell Reborn Treasure, and I I just 
I just didn't want to give a star, but nevertheless, I'm I'm I, I when my kids told me suck it up. Sometimes when you make you do things, you got to live with what you do. I just thought I could fix it back and get her back and then send this one because this baby was made for the for that person, that particular person. But I wanted to give Star because she had nothing but Nate baby and I wanted to keep it going. I was trying to do something good, but I didn't know it was going to hurt me, make me feel some type of way. And it did. But right now, I've been, you know, babying her, trying to, you know, do this and that or whatever. I changed her clothes five or six times already since she's been here. And she is a pretty girl. She's pretty and stuff. Star had human hair. Um, and she was done by Slade by me, her hair. And she was reborn by Nate, Little Sugar Nursery. This baby was done by Teresa, which is Baby Star Reborn Treasure. And this is her. I'm just going to love her. She just, you know, it is. So, sis, you go ahead and make your video of your beautiful daughter and be happy with her. She got a new mom, and she and you guys, I got to say, she got a great mom. I ain't got to worry about her. She's in good hands with all stay. And, and now I am asking if I'm not giving babies out. I got a couple of people to give out to. If I do, it's going to be only to certain people. And those people, I'm asking if I give the baby out. And if you decide to sell it, return it back to me so I can gift it out to another person. Because I I mean, I got so many people coming to me saying, if you had to give that baby to me, I wouldn't have sold it. Everybody's selling the babies you get. I mean, I get that so much. And I'm really tired of hearing it. I used to didn't care, but you hear it so much till you just say, okay, okay. Well, okay, look at it. Because I say, once you give something to somebody, it's there. But they were saying, but yes, if you gift it to them, that's different. They shouldn't sell it. So my thing is this. If I gift it and you don't want it, return it to me and I gift it to someone else. That's the way I'm going to do it now. But I'm not gifting out like that no more because it seems like a lot of people have done this. And it let me know, like they said, like everybody that's talking to me said they didn't want no baby. They just wanted to sell it for money. I don't know what they wanted. I can't say that because I'm not in their head and mind. But all I'm saying, if I do give, it's going to be a person that really want one, a person don't have now. And when God tell me, it ain't just cold. No, you ain't got to come to my channel because I can shut my channel down. It don't matter to me. I mean, you don't have to come see me. I don't care if I got three people. I'm just saying, if it's you here for a baby, don't be here for a baby. That's all I'm saying. Because this is not what my channel is for. It's not for you to come here just to get a baby. Because I was told by a lot of people, uh, only reason they come is because people are saying, oh, go to her video. She do baby just come in and tell her her baby's cute her baby did and she'll give you a baby and i started laughing but then after i laughed my dog my kids say mama that ain't funny you laughing but that that's the reason that's what they doing i don't know this is what i'm hearing i mean i'm hearing for so many people that come to me so i don't know but my thing is i changed it so if I want to sell a baby, I sell a baby. If I gift it, I gift it. But I, I, I feel differently. If somebody gifted, why not gift it to someone else that is selling it? Yes. And now, I'm not talking about when I accepted those, those that I accepted that way is fine. And those that came to me, they fine. You know, cause, or I had certain people came to me and say, Miss Billy, is it okay I sell so and so, so and so, so, and I gave them okay. And those people, I'm fine because they did come to me. And, and I thought that was really sweet that they did. So, you know, but I'm just saying now, it's just only for those that really need them. Because sometimes you give the, a person a baby, and their collection, they got high-end doll. So if I give them a baby five. Hundred, six hundred dollars. They may not want that baby. They may want that, like that fifteen hundred, two thousand, three thousand dollar reborn. Yeah, yeah, I can understand it. And that's not you. I'm not gifting to you. I'm gifting to the new people that need one, want one, really do. And I, I got in mind now who do. I, I 
I, people on Facebook have taught me a lot about how to do things. And they even told me to go come to them and they'll direct me to a person that really want it. And so far, they have did good because these people really do because they don't have them. And they they just grateful. So I'm just saying, this is the, this the new thing before 2020. And anybody else that I didn't say this to before, I guess it don't go to you because I didn't even make, mention that. I didn't even care. But what making me look at it is too many people's coming to me. And then my kids said something about that. Cause, you know, what they send me, my kids read. I don't know. They be all up in my kool -Aid. But anyway, I'm done. Guys, I'm leaving. I'm keeping my channel. I won't be on all the time. But I come on and show my babies and stuff. My beautiful baby. Because she's she a big old fat pretty baby. Look at her. I share her and definitely share my beautiful silicone. I My silicone, I like to dress her differently than anybody. I know somebody say, well, well, you can't dress them up every day. Why not? Uh, this little girl got nothing. She got three, four. She got four outfits. This color. Dress it. If I put her on another dress tomorrow, it'll be this same color, but it'll be different. So, I, and that's why I say I may put them on back to back. And just put her on video, but y'all see it's different. But this one got a jacket. I think another one got a jacket too. Yeah, it got a little coat. So she gonna get dressed in Sunday best tomorrow, and it's gonna be gold too. And with her shoe, but it'll be different shoe. But these shoes are so cute on her. I thought they were just too cute. But anyway, guys, take your arm and wrap them around yourself. Sweeties, real tight. That's Yahweh. Pray for us as we pray for you, God. Guys. It's so nice to be on here showing my two beautiful daughters. And I'll be back on probably tomorrow with Baby Faye dressed differently. And uh, I have the baby Kyra by Jamie Delard. She'll be here Monday or Tuesday. Then my Joseph Wake should be here Tuesday. And uh, I, yeah, I'm... I'm going to get the short right now. I'm not in the mood dressing all these babies. I may just do these two right now because she's new. And for me to get used to her because she, she can't replace Star, but she's added to the family. But she's a cutie. I put earrings in her ears over there. And she's cute, though. She got the big fat face. Look at her big old fat chunky hair. Okay. I love you guys. And thank you for stopping by. And thank you everybody for all the support that you've been giving me about trying to help me stay on the video i got so many people i didn't know i was loved by that many people and then i'm not gonna say that because i was happy then somebody said something to me and it kind of made me a little sad because i'm like really you you think that <laughs> but if y'all don't love me Y'all better not go lay down the rest because I'm telling you, God said love everybody, okay? I love y'all. And, and I'm talking about real love. And loving a person don't mean buying a person nothing. You can love a person in heart and you don't have to buy them nothing. But anyway, take care. God bless. And thank y'all for stopping by. I guess I'm done. Say bye, baby Faye. <coughs> Here she is.